This is one of my absolute favorite new arena offense units. I know she first came out, we were hyping her up, we were hyping her up, then people were trashing her. They're like, oh, she's not that good. I have been using her. I really, really enjoy this unit. She's got, ever since she got second awaken, her skill three is just so good. The unfortunate downside to that is that she does require very good rune efficiency. Even the one that I have is still not enough rune efficiency. She does require a lot of damage. She requires 100% crit rate, which we don't have. She also requires some good accuracy. Skill 1 is basically nothing. Skill skill 2 is defense break, attack age absorb. It's kind of similar to the uh, Helena. I don't have this fully skilled up. I wish I did. I'm out of Devil Bonds because I need Devil Bonds for everything. Comet summoning, though, this is the thing that is super important to make sure that this is scaled up. Summons Comets. I mean, this is kind of pretty... Harmful effect rate is pretty important, too, not gonna lie. If I if I had anything available, I would do it. Uh, Comet summoning some of these comments to attack all enemies three to four times, each hit applying one of the following effects for two turns. Decrease attack power, decrease attack speed, increase chance of a glancing hit, beneficial effects block, target defeated by this attack and not be revived during battle. I love to use this damage and cool time turn are massive uh, upgrades. They definitely need to be uh, definitely need to be upgraded. I have her just on speed, crit damage, attack. Here are the runes, here are the artifacts. Um, Yes, they could be better, but she's been doing good so far. I really enjoy taking her into Samoth, Clara, Savannah, Nana kind of defenses. Let's play around with her and let's see. Let, let me show you how good she is. So here's the team that I like to use this with. It's very similar to how people are using Leia the Light Blade Dancer. However, I don't personally have Leia the Light Blade Dancer. And this is, in my opinion, a little bit better against the Nanas on defense because you do see Nanas on defense. So it can take care of this uh, Samoth. It can take care of the Nanas. It also will attack, break, and glancing hit on these two units right here. So we're going to uh, outspeed. We're going to speed buff, tech gauge boost. We are going to strip and decrease the enemy's attack gauge. In reality, he has 100% uh, accuracy, so in reality, he's just going to get resisted. And then we're going to attack buff defense break, and then do our big damage. Glancing hit everyone, uh, attack break everyone, so they shouldn't do a crazy amount of damage after that, right? <laughs> in theory, in theory, they shouldn't do a crazy amount. Also, Clara, as soon as you get her down on HP, she... And we need to speed tune thing. Oh, she wasn't on Will Rune, so we didn't uh, decrease her attack age as much as we could have. So the dangerous thing about taking this into a 33 speed lead with a 24 is that can happen, and that's kind of dangerous. So let's do our Comet Summoning. We're going to get Attack Power Bricks. We're going to get Glancing Hit. Oh, we're, never mind. Kaki's not even going to... Not even going to come back. So we are good. Let's go on to the... Man, we, let's go on to the next one. So this one specifically is not the thing that I built this for. I built this for Samoth, Clara, Savannah, Kaki, things like that, and, and, and Nanas. But when in Rome, do as the Romans do and eat spaghetti or something like that. Listen, I don't, I don't know. I've never been to Rome. So we got the strips. Do we actually do it? The question is always, do we land them? Always the question, do we land the strips? Comet summoning, everything that this kills is not going to come back from the dead. Right? So we still have to worry about... I mean, we just kill the Kaki. That's not the point. But if we didn't kill the Kaki, he would still have an attack power break. And a defense break, actually. Because Kaki, uh, Kaki's uh, defense break is, is strong against Kaki. He's going to stop his extra damage. Another nice defense. Again, this is not specifically what we built this for. But we don't have to worry about the Nana. We don't have to worry about the Vanessa. Unless we don't kill, and then we have to worry about absolutely everything. <laughs> okay, so we didn't strip. So this is going to be an issue, potentially. Let's do this. Wonderful. Okay, she didn't even do her thing. Okay. And then she's dead. <laughs> then Kaki solos. Hold on, guys. Oh, he can't solo if he's... Yes, he can. He can definitely solo if he's stunned. This isn't the team that we built this for, though, but... See, these teams, though, these are the ones that I don't hit with this team because just the Triton being in here, the 33 speed lead, the 116 base speed, we're already at two disadvantages. If they farm just a little bit worse runes than we did, they still win. So I don't like to hit these teams with this because there's really less of a chance to actually clear these, even though I really like to hit these three units with this team. That Triton in there is going to be, is is the deal breaker. This is a beautiful defense for this team to hit. Hopefully, Clara has Will Runes, and we strip them. We really shouldn't hope that it has Will Runes, and we strip it. Although, we could also take a fire, not a fire. We could take, um, she doesn't have Will Runes, crap. 
All right, we did decrease the attack gauge. Let's see if we get cut. Hopefully, we okay, we don't get cut. But we could also take a wind demon and a, like a super fast wind demon and something else team. What, am, what else am I thinking of? The, the other monster. <laughs> the other this is the team I was talking about. Mephisto, Julie. I don't know why Julie. The other monster. Oh, wow. There's only like seven, eight hundred monsters in the game. The other monster. We know exactly which one you're into. Mephisto and what? Mephisto and what, buddy? Uh, so, yeah, this is a team that I like to take into this. This is not really a video where we're showing this. It's just I I enjoy taking Mephisto into these. Um, the Mephisto and Julie into these twins teams. Julie doesn't really care. Julie doesn't ignore defense, but if you have enough. <clears throat> That's just gonna make it take longer. Thank you. I appreciate <laughs> appreciate that. We could just uh, we could just auto this. But if she's got enough additional damage and artifacts, plus she just does a lot of damage anyway. And this is not even the best built Julie because she's got a lot of speed on her, so she's still lacking as much as she could do. She can do a lot more. But I wanted to make sure we had enough uh, speed on this unit. I think she got just like speed on slot. Two. Either she's speed on slot two or she's swift. I think she's speed on slot two. Speed crit damage deck probably on uh, probably on rage. So back to the team that we we're supposed to be looking at. We can take this into uh, this one. We've got the Vanessa Clara. So they do have a 33 speed lead. We'll see if we are going to... Do they have will runes? Do they not have what They don't have the will runes. Well, we can still stun them, though. Potentially. So we have, we have a couple options. Right? Either they have will runes, or if they don't have will runes, hopefully they are not going to be fast enough. Which you never know how fast they're actually going to be. Okay, can't revive. And then these things are going to be... Like, you don't know that she's necessarily even... A couple things. Number one is you don't ne know necessarily after she's that low on HP, her AI is going to do whatever her AI feels like doing. It's not guaranteed to do... Um, it's not guaranteed to do skill three. Another thing is if we had the glancing on her, which we don't have, but if we did have the glancing on her, then she might just glance. It might not do anything with her skill two. Uh, sc uh, sorry, skill three. Why can't I think of anything today? My brain is just mush, as usual. This defense has an Abelio on it, which is a little bit of an issue, but it's not as big of an issue as Molly or Ariel. I would be more scared to fight a Molly or Ariel. Like, this defense uh, with the uh, Samas, Clara, Savannah, and then a Molly or Ariel, because then they could turn all of our debuffs into uh, heals, and that would be not a, not a whole lot of fun. All right, so we got the Comet summoning. Like, could you imagine the Ariel <laughs> turning all that into heals? That would not be fun. And then the Molly could just stop us from doing anything, right? Oh, we didn't even get the... Let's... Uh, can we can we kill with Jealousy? Or Dismount, rather. I know we're not going to kill. But hopefully we get the Dismount. Let's do the Massacre. Oh, I thought we were going to get that. And then as soon as we do that... I'm more worried about that. The, the Savannah's not going to do anything at that point, so... This one, Linda is so strong against this defense. We've got the Perna, we've got the Samoth. Both of them are not going to be able to revive if she kills them with skill 3. We also have block beneficial effects and heal blocks, so we have three different units that counter the Halfus. I'm not sure if we'll actually counter him. This is Summoner's War. If you bring three counters to a unit, that doesn't necessarily guarantee that the unit will ever be countered <laughs> under any circumstances. So, I appreciate the uh, the will runes there. Can we stun? We did decrease attack. It. We do get some stuns. Not on. The, I wanted to stun on the Clara. But, let's see if we actually get the... Uh... Nice! We got the block beneficial effects on the Clara. And then we got... <laughs> it's fine. We, we have the... Uh, we have, like I said, we have three counters to the Halfus. So, we should be good. For, that was not that crazy of a defense, though. So this team is perfect to hit, in theory. The thing is, though, this is weird to see this up this high. You really don't see things without a stripper up this high, because you like if you just take shield and will, that's the counter to the the defense. So this is this is an abnormal defense. This is easily countered just by shield will. You don't need to have Linda in here. You don't need to have anything in here. You just take shield will. That just counters the defense already. So. Doesn't come back. Doesn't come back a second time. We got the speed break, which is going to stop Savannah from doing anything. Vanessa's not going to do anything. Nobody's going to do anything with anything. It's going to be... <laughs> nobody's going to do anything with anything. Guys, this is the commentary. It's going to be a very boring time because no one's going to do anything. Oh, wait. Hold on. Was The comp to us was upset with me. It's like, how dare you? How dare you show a three-star? 
People need to buy LD5s. This is the point of the game. Guarantee, guarantee we are going to stun the Ongyuki. That is the unit that we're going to get. We're going to get the stun on the Ongyuki. Everything else is going to be fine. Stun on Ongyuki. He comes in. He demolishes us. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. Okay. Wait, do we get cut? I hope we don't get cut. Okay. We get this. We get this. We get this. And then we get... It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Although Tiana can wipe our team. Hold on. Tiana can wipe... Oh, she didn't. Okay. That was very nice of her to not wipe our team. Such a, such a sweetheart. So this is the team I like to hit this with the most. I don't know if we've even hit this one yet. I don't know what teams I'm including in the video and what teams I'm not and whatever. I've just been hitting like a whole bunch of stuff. So, but this is really nice. We're, we're, we're going to stop the, uh, we're going to stop the Nana. We're not going to stop the Nana. We're not going to stop anything. Nothing's going to work. <laughs> I've got the, okay. <laughs> I mean, it is, but look at this. Oh, we didn't get the glancing. We got the attack power break. We got the defense break. He's going to, oh, we can just finish. It's just a smart idea. We don't want to take any chances. Why do I sound like it? I'm from Alabama. So ultimately, it's a fun team to use. You can't bring it in against everything, but it's good against Speed Lead, Samoth, Perna, Nana, Savannah, Kaki. There's a decent amount of new stuff that it's uh, that it's good against. I wouldn't recommend bringing it into Tritons or Wunsas or Mollies or Ariels, things of that nature. Also, we do need... It requires... She requires a lot of rune efficiency to actually... Because this is not even enough speed. As you saw in the very beginning, it's not even enough speed. So... Uh, she does still need more work, but her base speed is not doing her any uh, any favors. But anyway, that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you as always. She's just, I'm still using her. My point is, I'm still using her in daily daily routine against some of these defenses, right? So anyway, that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you as always in the next one.